Hello and welcome to the show. We are back on GTA 5 doing some more racing. We are back at the Golf Raid circuit. You see, there is some unfinished business between me and this circuit. Last time when we played around here, it's a great fun track to go racing with. However, the last race that we went around, I was in a battle for the lead for the entire time until the final lap, but I met a tree and I fell to about eight. So, I A, want to do better, and B, we just kind of want to go racing. Uh, again, around this uh, around this circuit, someone's going to end up in a flagpole if they're not careful. Our first race is with the trophy truck and raid trucks. We got through that uh, opening melee there relatively, oh, well, I had, and I got hunted around and again and again. Good God, people, that's a... It was a brilliant start by me, actually. We stayed clear of the chaos, and then, well, okay, I've just returned the favour to somebody. Uh, not sure that one was fully deserved. These trucks kind of swap ends very quickly. Oops! <laughs> Someone sunk it. <laughs> that was just such a, a brilliant sinking as well. <laughs> it was just a straight in, the, straight in the water, almost unexpectedly sunk. And that's the, that's the best kind, just the unexpected uh, unexpected fall in the water. Right, oh, there's a gold one pointing the right. I don't know how they've managed to spin there. Probably some assistance. Uh-oh, that's some flying towards trees. Oh, got on the, I got on the brake to try and avoid this mayhem. And other vehicles have had exactly the same idea as me, and that's put us in all sorts of busyness. Someone else has rolled over. These things tumble over quite easily. Not as easily as our next vehicles, however. Uh, come out of all of this mayhem in sixth place, which is not too shabby. Someone's avoiding the jumps. You have to take a bit of a wonky line, though, if you're going to try that. I'm not going to try it. Okay, we are going to go for that, because they were bouncing around horribly. Didn't really want to go for the aerial overtake. However, it's happened, and we've done it now. So, there we go. Uh, whoa, that was someone just spiralled off the one of the ramps there. Might have been some lag. If it wasn't, though, that was a mighty impressive accident uh, across there. They, managed, they must have recovered it um, because I didn't see a vehicle actually skidding down the road on their roof. Right, let's not fight with the... Oh, as I say, let's not fight with the trees. We get a massive oversteer twitch from our vehicle. We're going to cross the line in fifth place. Now, Slipstream and Catch Up are on, as they do tend to be with our races on, on GTA 5, just for mayhem's sake, basically. We just want lots of cars racing for, for position and so on, especially around a track like this. Of course, we are going to be a little bit more spread out now, and that's kind of quite a good thing. I'm not sure you'd actually want Slipstream around that sort of a jump. You're going to end up overshooting if you're not careful and uh, into some of the scenery the pink raid truck is leading the way got a relatively comfortable margin of uh, lead for him in fact extended it a little bit although i say that i don't know if he might have got taken out there by or that might be a different one i'm not sure uh, there was a, no, the pink truck still leading a purple truck got taken out by one of the vehicles behind me anybody gonna meet a tree no everybody has done relatively well at avoiding that uh, kind of one of the tricks with this that you will uh, you will find quite quickly is we actually want to be keeping the trucks in the air as little as possible and not in the signs if we can avoid it uh, that was a bit of poor driving by me there yeah you kind of want to keep them in the air for as little time as possible so you want to take routes that avoid the bunkers that, uh, that, that preferably avoid that sort of shenanigans oh I thought he was going to explode there on that landing he didn't um, yeah you want to avoid the bunkers you want to avoid all of the hills and so on that you can so I'm sorry to the other orange truck there that uh, kind of got tangled up with me um yeah, he got, you know, we got in trouble across the jump, basically. <laughs> so, there's not much you can do. The jumps can cause issues around here, just because of the speed that we're kind of approaching them and so on. I'm not going for that horrible, horrible gap. I don't trust it anymore. My trust has been broken on this circuit. We've got a couple of laps to try and make some progress. We were making progress that was then all harshly undone by a, uh, a sign and me trying to be a little bit too brave and take speed and, and trying to avoid, avoid bumps, etc., the leader is going to... Oh, someone sunk it. Oh, you've got it out, though. Well done, good sir. Well done, indeed, for uh, rescuing that out of the pond. I couldn't do that with the uh, brawler last time around. So, uh, yeah, that is a, a good recovery. You've got to be really careful because you want to cut the corner there, but you cut it too much and you won't hit the checkpoint, and then you will be done for. Uh, oh, get across before that thing hits us. Oh, just that was very, very narrow. Very narrow indeed. The blue truck is flying at all sorts of wonky angles through the air. He's getting away with it, though, on the landings. Don't roll over. Don't roll over. Try and keep it off the bumps. Uh, oh, okay, we're going over this way now. Didn't really want to go play with that sign again. Uh, there's a better line through there that I'm just not finding at the moment. Come on, we can get a podium. We can get a podium if we can get everything together. Try not to do that. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. And out of the golf course. Can we do an... We can do an aerial J-turn. We're going to probably lose a place, but not as much time as we could have done. 
<laughs> that is the first time I've ever done an aerial J turn in a uh, in a racing game. I can tell you that much. Uh, the leader is miles clear at the moment. He is enjoying a massive, massive lead as we are all squabbling for positions further back. I'm pretty sure second made a mistake and was dropped back into the clutches of third. So had we not gone for that little bit of a spin, we might have stood a chance. There is some bravery going on with the trees. Hopefully that will bite somebody in the ass and I won't feel like such a moron. Um, so I'm, 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 I found I'm 100% sure I'm not going to be the only one that gets caught out by those trees. It is a, uh, an easy and silly mistake to make. Uh, I'm trying to be a little bit cautious across some of these bumps, especially when that sort of thing goes on. Uh-oh. 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 Oh. oh. <laughs> thought I was going to land on him. I really thought we were going to land on the pink truck. He's now found a different tree. Not my horrible tree, but uh, we are right there for all the position. The problem is the more that we fight each other, the more that the trucks up ahead of us can get away. I'm trying to use the... Uh, green, kind of the edge of the green there to get my truck turned. It, it all works a little bit, but I couldn't carry enough speed. Uh, we're going to take a little bit of a lift there just to try and avoid landing on the tree. Problem is, yeah, I'm trying to take smooth lines so I don't do that sort of thing, but in doing that, you might have to be a little bit cautious and, uh, yeah, we're not quite making up enough time. Not making up enough time in all of this. Uh-oh, 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 we're going to land awkward. No, we got away with it. We got away with it. Okay, we've got a lap. Oh, hello, pink truck. That's not a sight you want to see. I've always said, the worst thing you can see in third-person view is another car's bonnet uh, at the bottom of your screen. We have a lap. Can we catch up to a podium spot? The leader is long gone. I've, I'm not... I daren't take my hands off the uh, controls long enough to move to look at the scoreboard because we've got a lot of control and a lot of fighting to do on this final lap. The leader is miles ahead of us. Unless they make a catastrophic error, they are gone. Third place, second place even, isn't completely out of the question, but neither is fifth if things go wrong for me here. Let's try and focus on get across the water this time, which we do. It was a little... We actually got the... I think one of the wheels got caught in between the uh, the couple of ramps there because we got a little bit twisted. However, we have made it through, critically, without being broken down. It's a great battle going on for second place ahead of me. Fantastic battle for second as they go side by side. I've lost my tail, which is nice. We don't have to worry about the uh, pink flamed truck behind us. Uh, I have a little lift down there just because I don't want to overshoot into the wall and get my truck on two wheels. It's a little bit slower, you know, approaching the jump, but I do get a better run off of the turn. The blue truck. Oh, blue truck's gone. Oh, he saved it. Holy crap, that is one hell of a save right there. He was bouncing and bouncing and barely in control. He gathered it all back up again. Oh, dear. I am... Uh, oh, no, he's recovered that one as well. <laughs> Tell you what. Bonus points for the uh, for the control right there from the blue truck as it bounced around manically. That is two incredible saves in the space of uh, about three quarters as we come up now towards these final turns. Don't get caught out by the oversteer, which is really easy to do around here. Don't go for the stupid gap in the trees. Truck behind might try it. Uh, don't know where he's gone. Blue truck might have made a mistake trying to push and uh, catch up there. We will take a podium spot in all of that one. Uh, so Always someone spawns in in the wrong vehicle. Bloody typical. Let's have a look at the... Uh, let's see if we can load. I don't know if there's any close battles going on elsewhere. We were involved in good battles, which is uh, always nice. Always nice to be in the midst of the action. Uh, there we go. Uh, relatively close on track. Lap time-wise, look at the... <laughs> Look at the lap times. 28.6, 28.6, 28.2, 35.29.9, 27.2. You've got to take the lap times with a little pinch of salt because um, they are done with catch-up. So some of the vehicles further down will get a little bit more performance. But all of us at the front that would be running with fairly similar levels of catch-up, uh, very similar lap times. Might be the closest top three we've had in terms of lap times ever in, uh, in GTA 5. Well... It's a, it's, it's a brilliant track. It's a brilliant race track, this one. Uh, oh, that's an that's a ending screen if ever I saw one. Brilliant race track. The trucks, uh, the raid trucks, trophy trucks, and so on, proving entertaining, entertaining racing up until the uh, last second there. I hope you're ready for the chaos, though, that is to come next. Yes, these are likely to be absolute carnage. And it is raining. And I am towards the front. And I'm stuck on the outside. Oh, bugger, is the uh, appropriate words, I think, for this race. We are off 
I'm going to be in the fence. Yeah, it was never likely to be good on the outside for the Junes. Oh, someone's tumbled over. Actually, relative. Oh dear. Oh dear. It was a relatively good start. It's then now not no, now not been a relatively good start. It's, it's not gone well there, has it now? Uh, <laughs> it's just so bouncy. These are the bounciest vehicles. You would think that being giant Dakar trucks, they wouldn't be the world's bounciest vehicles, and then you would be completely and utterly wrong. Someone sunk one. <laughs> uh oh. They're gonna fly massively, massively wonky. And oh, no, 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 we can't. We just can't turn them. Uh, then, oh, someone's gonna go swimming. Uh, we're gonna help them if they're not. No, don't turn that way, you twat. Ah. Uh, someone has got it drowned in the uh, in the pool of there. Uh oh, uh oh. I'm gonna. No, no, they're breaking as well. Okay, fine. I was gonna let them go because they're just kind of ahead of us. But uh, you know, <laughs> oh, we actually got to escape the golf course. I didn't know you could get out there. Uh, <laughs> That would be an interesting turn of events to uh, suddenly escape the golf course mid race. I mean, somehow, in all of this mayhem, we've come out in seventh place, which is surprisingly good. Uh, uh oh. Oh! We got away! We got lucky! That is about the first time I've been lucky in this race in all of eternity. There's one doing a wheelie. I don't know what on earth they've done to have that happen to it. Um, yeah, we're up into fourth. We're almost rolling over. Got to be very, very careful with the tumbly, rolly, fully overy truck, as uh, these things bounce around a lot on the landings of jumps, and they don't always like getting back onto all four wheels. Oh, we're just about okay there. We're just about okay there. Third place isn't. Third place is parked on their side. We might be joining them. No! No! We have joined them, although we've got going quicker. Come on! Come on! You might only have two wheels on the ground at most times, but we can make up positions! Maybe. We've got a little bit of clear air back to the vehicles behind, much like we did have last race when we were running in fourth on that final lap. This time, though, we've got a lot more laps to try and make progress through the field. Potentially, that's a that bush is horrendous trying to navigate our way through there. Uh, they're going to go. That's uh, yeah. That's it's quite awkward actually. This final corner. I, again, I'm not bra not not braving that <laughs> with a Dakar truck when I couldn't do it with a brawler. Uh, oh, you're going to bounce across there. Oh, it's the it's the. Oh, come on, get that down again. It's the, yeah, the kind of the suspension compressors, it launches the vehicle up into the air in kind of weird, weird ways across some of these. Like you don't have to be going very fast and it, it literally bounces the, the truck into the air. So you've got to be really, really wary of that as a thing that happens. Uh, oh, that was a great, oh, it was a great, it was a great jump, but a terrible landing. And we don't want to go rolling our way into the lake, particularly. It's not really an ideal circumstance. That would be first and second up ahead of us in the two blue, various tints of blue trucks. Don't know where the uh, dark blue vehicle ahead of me is planning on going there, but never mind. Uh, again, as I said, we've got a uh, relatively clear run to the vehicles behind us. We just need to not make any mistakes, and that's easily done as well, both of us fly a little bit awkwardly across that jump. I'm going to roll. He's going to end up blocking the road. So none of us have really lost too much time in all of that. <laughs> well, relative to each other, none of us have lost too much time in that. He blocked the road. It would have been annoying if I'd actually landed on all four wheels, which I didn't, so it doesn't really matter. That's going to help fifth place catch up to us if they're not having... There's actually a real big... There's a huge tussle for position further back that I'm very, very keen to get across here before they all come entangled with us. Uh, yeah, there was a massive fight going on for... I think it might even be for fifth place back. I think they're all in a little group. We're at the front breaking away slightly. I mean, catch-up is all well and good, but these things are so bouncy. If you get things wrong on the landing, you get tips, you land on your side, you roll over, and hell, if that happens at a narrow point on the track, you block everybody behind you. If fifth place made a mistake on one of the very, very narrow parts of the track, got their truck up on its side and blocked unintentionally blocked the field, then, uh, yeah, you're going to have a, a tough, tough time. Oh, we might be catching up to the lead battle. We, in fact, we are catching up to the lead battle. We have caught very, very quickly to the lead battle over that last lap. It's possible that they had a, a coming together around one of the final corners. Um, or that the catch-up is maybe working. I don't, I'm not sure. Not sure which, but it looks like it might become a four-truck... Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um, that's not great. Now, these things won't get sunk by the looks of things in the uh, in the drink. We're going to just bounce around, reverse, the re <laughs> as you do. Done a reverse J-turn. That was some reverse checkpointing. We're not doing auto test at the moment. We don't need to do them in reverse. However, sometimes, if it's quicker, I will. You're going off exploring into the fence once more. It's respawn. Not for not for long, though. We all go for... I'm going for a tighter line. I'm just trying to get the get out of the corner. Again, it's, it's all about oh, avoiding that sort of thing. <laughs> He's got sunk. The leader's in the... Oh, that's some, that's some great going. Oh, crap. 
Oh, oh, I thought I could make up, maybe make up a position for the lead there. Great save from the truck ahead of us. I also had to do a fairly similar save. Not quite as uh, spectacular in many ways. Well, I've worked my way up into a second place. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. Get it back on its wheels. No. Bad things have happened to my truck. Bad thing, real bad things have happened to my truck, and real bad things are going to happen to. Other, I'm trying to get clear. Trying to get clear. Everyone's tumbled over. <laughs> the leader's gone again. Ah, <laughs> oh, couldn't save that one. Could not save that one. I'm so good that the trucks behind were a lot further back, because otherwise, if they'd been a lot closer, they'd have ploughed into the side of me, and then there would have been roadblock central. Nothing anyone can do about that. Uh, it looks like Reese is mating with a building over there, so we'll just leave him to it. I don't quite know what, uh, <laughs> what happened to him to get at that point. That's uh, well done. Uh, well done indeed. Uh, we are going to have fallen back some 15 seconds. Yeah, 15 seconds in two laps. Without a mistake, it's going to be very, very difficult to catch. Uh, unfortunately for us, yeah, not much that can be... I say not much that can be done about that. We've got to not make any mistakes here. Uh, don't go pushing the truck too hard. Uh, that's, that's a quick way to lose a lot of time. It does look like they might actually be coming up to some lapped traffic. That could play uh, an interesting role in all of this. That was neatly done. For once, on the landing of a jump, we didn't get horrendously spat around. Fantastic. Uh, we've lost third place ever so slightly. Um... That's, that's that's good news. I have to worry about them less, but it does also mean that they might end up being in an awkward place when it comes to the crossovers. No, it doesn't seem like it. There are some vehicles that are uh, laps down. There's somebody else in the river down there. How have you rolled that into there? That is some impressive going to have got your Dakar truck. <laughs> How have you done that? How on earth have you managed to put it into the drink there? Uh, they've got a reset. Now I'm going to have to be start fighting with lap traffic and... God knows, vehicles from all sorts of crossover points. Ooh! I spy the leader. Looks like the leader may have got into trouble across some of these uh, bunkers. No! No! Oh. A lap down vehicle getting in the way has cost me a chance at a lead. And we're going to... Uh, yeah, that's, that, that's, what I, that's what I think. <laughs> Don't you bloody dare. God damn it. The leader made a mistake, and then we got screwed over by somebody else getting stuck on the... or bouncing around and rolling over the ramp. Unless... unless the leader... Because, I mean, we caught that the 15 seconds is now going to be... Well, it's actually now back out to 16 seconds. And, yeah, unless they have a big roll somewhere, we are not going to have a, a grandstand finish. That much is for sure. We run a little too deep into there. So a slightly awkward line through here. We do look relatively safe for second. Again, unless I have a big accident, you've got to kind of... Uh, I want to try and push for the lead, but I also am very, very well aware how easy that is to um, make a mistake. When you're pushing for the lead, when you're trying to go quick around here, you, you especially with these, you're going to roll it. And I could really do without a, a roll. We are going to get the front end up well enough. Kind of the trick with this, from what I'm experiencing at the moment, is you've got to get the nose down enough for the landing of the jumps. If you don't get the nose down, that's when it bounces. Uh, if you know you end up clonking the front bumper on the floor, or kind of the front assembly on the floor, it doesn't really matter so much. In fact, in some cases, you kind of want that to happen, so that uh, that takes all the impact, rather than the suspension boinging and, and launching the truck up into the air. The leader is, is already, I think, too far gone. Unless, again, he could have an issue trying to get out of the golf course. That is perhaps the one of the most dangerous sections coming up towards that. And uh, if it does tumble over there, then you can you know, can sometimes get lucky and have a quick recovery. Or you can be stuck there for ages trying to uh, rescue it. However, he is out of the golf course. I think I saw him in the distance with an orange truck. The orange truck's got stuck on its side. Oh, we've got hit big time on that... Uh, Oh, no, 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 we're over. <laughs> I had some speed coming out of there and we've tried to use it all there. That thing's wobbling down the road like a maniac. Ah, oh, we were we were robbed of a uh, grandstand final lap. We have closed the gap of uh, some seconds. Uh, some seconds. We, we, we had probably halved the gap, but it was then all quickly undone by me uh, rolling, coming out of the golf course, pushing, I say pushing a bit too hard, just... <laughs> Doing what I could with the speed that I had available. It is going to be a second place, though. It's going to be a second place for me in the dunes relatively comfortably.
in second as well there. A lot of mayhem went on behind us. I think that was the orange, the, the lap down orange truck battle has <laughs> ended in a tree. Um, yeah. There was a lot of opening lap chaos, and then there was a four a four truck breakaway at the front that uh, was very briefly a four way battle for the lead. Oh, there's going to be some shenanigans across the line by the looks of that. that was some shenanigans and a half right there. That was some real shenanigans. I don't know what position that was for, third or fourth, I think, going on there. We saw that briefly. It does take it a year to load uh, the, the the seeing of the mayhem, but uh, it was for I believe for place potentially or it could have been it could have been a lap down vehicle to be fair i don't actually know uh fastest lap wise a 46.9 would be the quickest that the trucks would get around here again gotta bear in mind the uh the catch up and so on i did not get a particularly fast lap i don't even know if i got a lap where i didn't fall over to be honest with you um <laughs> but there we go yeah june's funnily enough racing around a very bumpy golf course is uh, quite uh, quite an interesting one. Are we going to have a uh, nice close finish here for position as we run through the street? No more bumps, no more jumps really to uh, worry about for these guys as they are heading side by side, actually remaining side by side for a long way through the streets here. Going to go around the outside on the run into the golf course. Oh, it's been a little bit of a, little bit of a bump, just too much asked of the trucks up on two wheels, ran wide, couldn't... Uh, couldn't quite make that one. It might be a, a tiny bit of lag as well. It's hard, it's hard to tell from uh, from that camera angle. Well, there we go. The dunes... Oh, someone's stuck in a building. Um, the dunes were excellent fun, and I got certainly some redemption with this one. A third and second place. Couldn't quite get a victory, but uh, I will take two podiums. That, though, is going to be it from me. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time... Uh, goodbye.